Hello, I'm Morris Dimba and today I'm going to show you how to convert beams and columns into single plates which you can then weld together to make up a build up members from single plates. Let's get started right away and I'll come straight to steel here. For us to create a beam, I'll click on steel, then I'll pick on beam option there, then uh, I'll snap on that spot and stretch all the way to 12 meters there, 12 meters there and snap right there. Now, if I bring it close, you can see it is a beam complete beam so we want to convert all this or, or, or we, we want to convert this beam to to three different components you want this part to be an individual plate and the upper part a, di a different plate and this one also to a different member now what i'm going to use uh, the key part is we, we want to convert we want to change the size of this beam now I'll come to apl application and component here and just type here plate beam here and double click on that macro here. I forgot to tell you the macro is plate beam converter. This is the, the tool that we'll be using to convert uh, a beam, the beam you have to a particular size that you don't have. Now once I've, I've double clicked on this if we take a look here we have a beam uh, a plate beam converter here and uh, at the bottom end of it you can see this arrow or uh, uh, an arrow similar to that play symbol now i'll click on that arrow and uh, the moment you, uh, the moment you click on it you'll be able to see select the beam or column confirm with the middle mouse button now i'll select on this then i'll press my middle button on the mouse and uh, once i've done that you can see here the top and the bottom flange are different and now individual members now if i mouse over this you can see it see it's different and this one also is where it has detached itself from the beam so i can go further and delete that and the other parts remain i can undo that because what i want to do is different to what i'm doing now now i want to increase the uh, the size of this beam now, what I'm going to do, I'll just double click here and come all the way here to, to the profile and increase these to 600 right here. I'll increase that to 600. And uh, what I'm going to do, I'll just go ahead and click modify and you can see the in increment. So what I'm going to do, I'll just select on it and click move and I'll snap at the bottom end here and move it straight to the top end here, top end right here. I'll snap right there. And also select on that right click and come to move and snap at the bottom end here and move all the way to this end we remember we've not played around with uh, with the thickness of this plate we'll just leave it at, at 9.1 because this is just a, dem a demonstration on how you can modify or make your own built-up members from tackle in tackle structures using special tools like plate beam converter tool to um, create your own members now once you've done that you can close this and now close the applications and component dialog box and if i come to view here i'll be able to rotate these like that and in this case the member the three members are still individual they're still individual members so i want to to make them as one i want to assemble all of them now what i'll do i'll just select everything here press control and uh, once i've selected all, all these then i'll right click and come to add to assembly and i'll add them here that's it so if i press alt and select that it's it's now a single member now you can apply this now this is ready to use as a component also you can uh, weld this if you don't want to use the assembly you can just undo here so when you select on that it's now individual now I'll come to weld here just type weld and pick on that then what I'm going to do I want to weld this to that and weld this one to that so if i come to press alt and select on that everything is it's joy is connected together so this is our built up beam we can use this 
and thanks a lot for watching and don't forget to subscribe to this channel and let's meet then at this the key point today is how to use how to make your own your own your built up members using special macros like uh plate uh plate beam converter so you can convert your beam to a built up member to a specific size of your preference thanks a lot for watching this video and uh let's meet then bye bye i'm always Nimba. if you don't if you're new to this channel don't forget to subscribe and let's meet then bye bye